Hello and welcome to the Wandering Wind. Today I'm going to be playing a game of Shin Megami Tensei 3 Nocturne. I will probably do some commentary as well, so just, eh, you know, watch and enjoy. Sorry if my, uh, Sorry if my voice is a little soft, but I don't really have an actual capture um, device yet, so I'm just using my webcam and my microphone to pick up the audio and video, so please bear with me. But this is one of my favorite Shin Megami Tensei games. For good reason, I think, too. I'm just gonna situate the microphone a bit more towards. There we go. Then that should be good for the video. And here we go. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and choose the name of... Tetsuo Shima, from one of my favorite movies, Akita. <laughs> so you can kind of figure out who the other two's character names are going to be. I'm going to go ahead and leave her name as it is, just because I don't remember any of the other characters from the movie, other than the three main ones.
I can't exactly remember the last guy, the, the uh, guy's last name, so I'm just gonna pick one. And here comes one of the first reasons why I loved this game. The enigmatic storyline. And how it presents itself through the characters in the game. I mean, really, it's, it's well thought out. Well done. I just, I love this whole thing. I mean... Um, Hayasaka Kaori Yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't go to a hospital if it weren't be able to be like, uh, <laughs> something's not right. Some guy gave it to me. Oh, <laughs> should have picked the second one.
Why would you bring something like that here? Well, I just got it. I haven't read it yet. I thought maybe it'd be good for some light reading. Huh. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Might help. Look for County to... Eh, well. Why not? Second floor, where the patient's rooms are. Oh yeah, let me borrow this magazine. Not even let me answer no. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Just, yeah. Oh boy. I'm not a big fan of the controls, though. The controls are kind of weird. I never could get used to them. Not to mention they're kind of mushy, just, you know, the way they are. Someone is in the other hallway. Oh, no. Oh, before I forget. Sir. Darn. Only got one. Well, one's better than none. Better. Better. <laughs> Dang, you scared the crap out of me. Well, if you weren't so easy to startle, I wouldn't be able to scare you. <laughs> Shinjuku Medical Center. And just relax. Actually, just a second, let me see about reconfiguring this. Maybe I can make it easier for me to get both the sound from the, from the TV and from the, and from myself. Should be better. How's that? Good? Good. I'll just leave it like that. And here we go. The actual game. Almost. Not quite, but we're getting there. Walk well, back down the steps. Yeah, these doors are locked. This is probably where they keep the dead patients that they experimented on. Oh no! A little disturbing. Demon worshippers. Right here in Japan. Anyway, they believe in this book of prophecy called the Scripture of Moroku. In this book, it says that chaos will dis befall the world. And these people are trying to make that happen. The reporter wasn't able to learn what is meant by chaos. It could mean worldwide terrorism or some other, some other tragedy, but... Ooh. Scary. No luck finding Mr. Cow. I even checked the men's room. Yeah, yeah. Lovely. Didn't need to hear that. 
Where were we? Oh yeah, read this part. A hospital on the east side of Shinjuku is closely linked to their plan. Well, that sounds like this is more to come in our next... <laughs> nice one. Worried about Miss the Cow, are we? Oh. Yeah, yeah, you go and check the second floor and I'll check the basement. Right. <laughs> I'm just skipping a lot of this conversation because I can basically tell you it's all filler. It's got some interesting points, but for the most part. And where the hell is that other... I know there was another... It's probably down in the... Yeah, it's down in the basement. But there's another um, vending machine I can get another drink from to turn into a potion later. Or maybe not a potion, but some sort of a extra. Now where was it that I saw that? I know it's I know it's gotta be somewhere. Unless it's not anywhere. Oh. Oh, it's back up on the second floor. So, go to the second floor. Unless I already got it. I think I might have already got it. Not oh, sure. I will make sure to check though. Vending machine is sold out. Okay. Maybe it's in the annex. Don't have a gate pass. Damn. Forgot about that. Have to wait for that. vending machines that you can get two different drinks from. But they're probably not in use anymore, so or it's probably no use now. Might as well just go get this over with. Meet Hikawa. Hikawa. Cyber's Technologies. Sir, sure, let's do Cyber Technology. Oh, scary. This must be where they sacrifice to the old gods. The old ways of blood and of magic. Oh, wait. Wrong show. <laughs> Someone died unpleasantly. So that was the morgue. The other one was just an operation room that turned into an occult ritual room. And here is what will become the save room. have here. Who dares to interrupt this stillness? How irritating. A well-known poet once said, April is the cruelest month. Why? Because it is then that one must wake up from a long sleep and face the barren world. Looking back on the past, it is evident that the history of mankind is comprised of meaningless events. The worthless overgrowth of a civilization blind with sins, continuous bloodshed and war, 
spend thousands of years of repeating the same mistakes again and again. The world must start over from the beginning. The way to salvation was foretold in the scripture of Moroku, and today is the day that the prophecy shall be fulfilled. The old world will sink like a setting sun, and a new world will rise in its place. Who are you? From what I remember, you're not one of our followers who survived the purge at the park. An acquaintance of Mr. Cow? Come to think of it, this was a hospital, wasn't it? I see, you came to visit her. However, even a pebble creates ripples when cast in water. I do feel pity for you, but your life ends here. Do not fear. All the inhabitants of this world will fall before long. Your time has come just a bit sooner, that's all. Just a second. Checking to see that I'm filming correctly. And I am, and I will cut that out. Face him or run away. What should I do? Eh, let's try running. What a futile attempt. One should face death honorably. Stop. Oh, she is not pleased in the least. What? Can't you let one person go? It should have absolutely no effect on our plan. The insignificance of the gesture makes no difference. I will not allow any exceptions. If you don't save him, I'll stop cooperating with you. Such a troublesome maiden. So we've got the maiden, which in initiates the apocalypse somehow, I guess. I'll leave the teaching to the teacher. Please leave this room. I would like to enjoy this blissful end in solitude. Okay. And now it is time for the conception. The end and the beginning. Well, not quite. First we have to meet the devil. Technically, you meet him twice before you even leave the area. Someone, up, someone is up ahead. I see. My, my. <laughs> Looks like I'm going to get a visit from an old, an old being. I made it in time, back there in the basement. I wouldn't want you to fall prey to a demon. Yeah, I heard. The conception. The rebirth of the world, an event that no human has ever witnessed. Huh. Well, isn't that a bit harsh? Event 
helps only lose all of its power. Huh. No, no regrets. Find me on your own. I promise that I'll tell you everything. The answer is to all your questions. <laughs> oh boy. Is this going to be like a teacher-student romance thing? I wouldn't doubt it. I've never played to the end, actually. I don't think I've even gotten halfway. And this was the first scene that really got me hooked with this game back when it came out on the PS2. Is that this particular scene the world dies and then the world is remade. about to enter my world. Show me your heart. You have nothing in your heart, not even a hint of reason. Well, I take offense to that. I have lots of reason. <laughs> For the one who will shape this world, this cannot be. Go and discover yourself. tell you that my little master has shown an interest in you. Poor human, he wants you to give you a special gift. It is vital that you received this gift. Please do not move. It will only hurt for an instant. Right. Right. An instant. spike growing out of the back of my neck. Gray. 
Knights are nice. I would get tattoos like that in real life if I could handle the pain. Magatama, the essence of demonic power. You have now joined the ranks of demons. You have become... My little master is always watching you, so don't bore him. You obtained the Magatama Maru Gare. From the command menu, you can view and ingest Magatama. Let's see. Soma. Huh. So I got Soma. For all that trouble. Oh well. consider the possibility. It's hard to believe, but if this is Shinjuku Medical Center, then I can't just rule it out. The conception, it really happened. I've seen the spiral like object somewhere before. If memory serves me right, it belongs to a man named Hikawa. He must have something to do with all this. You think? Well, I thank you guys for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I will see about making another video here soon. Along the same lines. In fact, I will try and make a video at least once a week with me playing this game. And hopefully soon you can um, actually watch me play this in HD without the whole bastardized setup for a game recording system. I mean, eh, it's okay, but I know it could be better. Anyway, hit that like button down below if you liked the video. Subscribe to my channel for future videos like this. Um, go ahead and um, leave a um, comment.
comment down in the comments section about what your favorite part of the game is and what you think I should do for my next game after this one or if you don't like this game tell me what game I should play instead and just you know thanks oh if you like visit my um, Twitter page and Patreon page the links are in the description and I would love for you to become loyal followers and loyal patrons for me here on this channel I thank you guys for watching this has been the wandering wind blowing in with another video this time a gaming video for once and I will talk to you again soon love you guys very much hope you guys have a great day and I will see you guys in the next one <laughs> also just so you know, I apologize for any and all interruptions in the video. That wasn't exactly my intention. That was just the way that it came out. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a nice day. Bye.